two on one now. Can you see anything yet? I see everything. You go, oh. What? Hit retry, hit retry. I think it's because I quickly joined your share play while it was. Okay, what are you doing? What? <clears throat> uh, why? <clears throat> Seriously, why? Why? Wait, are we good? Are we in? It looks like it's good now. Good, go, go, come on. Nice. I should see if the Hitman 1 is going on. So there's another sale at GameStop, but some games. You know, Why are you going to get Hitman 1? What? Why are you getting Hitman 1? What do you mean? Everything, pretty much all the Hitman 1 stuff you can get in this game for the leg Legacy Pack, 20, 20 bucks. Yeah, but if the first <laughs> game is... I think the first game is only about 20 bucks or something. Still, I don't know, I get look. it in this game. And then you can, and then you can bring all your stuff... From like the first game into the second game missions, it's better just to get it in one game instead of two different ones. Cause then you yeah, have one but thing. I, I I like having the cases. I don't know. I'm weird. All right, what am I going with? Go, the gun? Um, get starting location. I want to see something. Wait, event entrance. Okay, your <coughs> start <coughs> dolphin fountain. Yeah, start there. Good. Okay, bring in. A lockpick. Uh, fiber wire, yeah, yeah. Replace that for the lockpick, and then go. You're good. Unless you want to change your suit, but that's what you need. Good, your, your difficulties on professional. That's what I left them on, the middle one. Wait, is that the old one all the way over? No, 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 that's the middle one. The one all the way over is master. There's casual, professional, master. Okay. You're yeah, in the middle one. This is good. That's what I played them all on the first time, too. That way it's not too easy, but it's still a challenge. So, hello, Hitman 2 Watchers on Lucky Team. This is your host, Pal. And playing with me today is Wes. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So go ahead and hit circle. Mm. Stand up. Good, now go in there. Are you building? Mm-hmm. You can hit your instinct to see where your targets are, if you're curious. And this race car driver and the guys up there. So you're on this side of the map now. The side near him. So. No. Head on yeah. in. So just walk around this desk. Ignore the desk. Eh, ignore her. Just walk around. Yeah, you're going towards this exhibition. Perfect. Okay, yeah. So I hope you're ready to do some sneaking. So start wearing. Keep going. So go to behind that car demonstration thing. Go back there. Yeah, I went that way the other day. Yeah, go this way. Just to warn you, uh, there's a person there and you're trespassing. Oh, no, there's not. Not yet. Okay, good. Now just go out there. Go ahead. You're fine. Uh, the other way. The other way. The other way. Crouch and go through that door to your right. No, no, no. To your right. Behind you. There. That door. I'm gonna go right to the left. Straight left. Nope, nope, just right through that door. Good! Okay, now yep. this is gonna put you See? in it. And then, I went up there, and then the mm -hmm. security like... thing went off. Oh, there's a camera there! I almost forgot about that! Use instinct to find the camera, where it is. 
So go up there, start start going up there slowly. Use instinct to find it. Keep looking at the instinct. Okay, there. No. No, stop. Turn back, turn back, turn back, turn back. Okay, you're fine. Pull out your gun now. Point it at the camera and shoot it. Make sure you're on it. Now go. Good. Go. Aha! Uh -huh. Go ahead. Now you're fine. Put your gun away, too. Uh, do oh, you p pick I, it up. I gotta get used to... See, I'm used to the Friday the 13th, where you drop things with that, or put it away, or something. What? No, you don't. Well, you don't no, put things that, away. No, I don't know what I'm thinking of. Yeah, just put it away. You're good. Up on the D-pad. Nice. Okay. So stay crouching. Here's what you're gonna do. Uh, where is the target? Uh, of course he's in there right now. The one place where you don't want him to be is to the right. Look to the right. Yeah, he's right there. That's not what you want. You want to just try to distract this guard. This is gonna be a little bit tricky. You're gonna have to use your coins. You're gonna throw one right about where you are now. Right? And then you're gonna pick it up and run in that bathroom to your right. Then, you're gonna throw one... Okay, let me run you through this. You're gonna throw a coin right about where you are now. That's gonna distract the guard out there. Hide behind that thing right now, by the way. Just do it. Just hide. Yeah. <laughs> you're fine. You're fine. Oh, no, you're not. You're not fine. Okay, well, don't, don't. Just stand up. Just stand up. They saw you. Stand up. Now follow him. Just follow him. He's gonna lead you out of here. Just follow him. Him? No, don't stand ahead of him. No, 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 the other guy. The other guy behind you, behind you, behind you. Before they start shooting at you. Yeah, that guy. Ah, uh, him. Oh, Okay, so you're actually gonna- you will be able to knock him out soon. Just follow him. Keep going. Knock him out right now. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, grab his disguise. Quickly, before anyone sees this. Take your gun out and shoot that camera down those stairs. Look at the stairs and there's a camera. Shoot it. Oh, shoot. Uh, use your instinct. Use your instinct. See where it is. It's over there to your right. Quickly. Shoot it. Shoot it. Okay, now grab, grab that body and drag it down the stairs a little bit. Before people find it. Quickly. Drag it. Hold the circle. I'll start dragging. Good. Okay. So you can leave it right down here. It won't be found, I don't think. So yeah, just leave it there. Okay, good. Now go up and just grab his gun so somebody doesn't find that. And you don't have to stop crouching. You're not trespassing anymore. You're good. So put that away, and now you're good. Nice, good job. So. Oh, shoot. Oh, uh, no, we don't want to do that. that. You... Yep, go back into that cross. That's security. Nice. So that wasn't exactly the way I wanted you to do it, but you got spotted, but that's okay. Yeah, you want to head up to that floor, so you want to go up a floor. Yeah, keep going that way. You're going the right way. Remember, the purple with the white dots over them are enforcers, and they can see through it. So this guy can't, but... You see a white dot above it, that means they can see through your disguise, and they know that you're not actually. So that guy up there, of course, that's right where you need to go. There's also a camera right there. But there's another way to go around him, so go to the right. Go to the right. I don't know if you've ever seen this mechanic yet. Yeah, go over here. there. <clears throat> there's a little mechanic, I don't know if you've seen. Yeah, see that window out there? There's a window. The one right there, to your left. That window? Hit X. Ooh, and there's a little ledge. So go over to the left and climb up. There's a little pipe there? Yeah, climb. They're climbing. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I'm up. And then hey, hang. Move over. Like that. Perfect. So. Go in there. Good. Yeah, go over there. In that door. Okay, so there's an enforcer out to your right. Right oh, out this door. If you, yeah, right there. Him. But you'll be able to sneak right by him. So just walk by. Don't, you don't have to crouch. Just walk by. He's facing the other way, so you'll be fine. He was that guy that you just avoided guarding that door. <laughs> that was him, so. Good. Now, run all the way to the, the end of this corridor. 
Yeah, I see. Now there's the room to your right with an enforcer. Not the one in the other room. Like, keep going straight, and then it's over to the right. Yeah, so look over there. There's the enforcer. Oh, perfect. Um, there's uh, something on the table. Uh, turn around. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Okay, well, just uh, grab the thing on the table and run. No, not that. Not that. Quickly, grab the thing on the table. Quickly. Now run. 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 Just run. 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 And stay out of that man's line of sight. He's going to follow you. So, yeah, just run through there. Good. Go. Go. Um... Oh, he can see through it, too. Oh, that's not good. Okay, go that way. Ah, good. To the right. Perfect. Okay, you're going the right place. Go down to the end of this hallway and take a left. And there. Back in that storage room. No, not up, not up there. Nope, 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 nope. The door where you came from. There. Perfect. Close that. Okay, then go out the other door again. Like where you climbed up. You're about to do this. Okay, so yeah, go out there, and use it on this laptop. Unlock it with the dongle that you just picked up. And then sabotage it. <laughs> I wanna hear your reaction to this. So, use your instinct, and you're gonna notice the target's gonna, over here, he's gonna come over here. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna be able to push him off, right? But you actually wanna wait. There's gonna be a time, a good time, where what's gonna happen is the target other the car is gonna be under it and it's gonna say kill. It's gonna normally say eliminate, but when you see it says kill, hit X button then, and then it's gonna kill both of them at the same time. And you're gonna get a cool little cutscene. So Yeah, I wanna hear what you have to say to this. So he should start coming over here. Yeah, he's coming up. So just wait there for a little bit. Well this is you're about to do this, Wes. You don't have to crouch, you're not trespassing or anything. You're allowed to be here, you're a guard. You can crouch, it's up to you, but... Yeah, if you don't see trespassing on the bottom left, you're totally allowed to be there. No one's telling you you can't be. Oh, here he comes! Oh, I really want to hear your reaction to this. Okay, so just kind of chill. His guard's gonna be there, but you can deal with him after. So just... He's gonna be like, hey, what's wrong with this? Now, he's gonna walk up to it. Don't do anything yet. Okay. Paul, oh, this is gonna work. Okay. So... Will it say kill where I'm standing? Yeah, it's gonna... Just, just, nope, you gotta... It'll be alright, just move closer to him. That's gonna say eliminate. Don't hit X yet. Wait and see where it says push. Wait till push says kill. And then hit X. Now, 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 now! Look at this. Watch this. <laughs> yeah, the guard behind you. Run around and punch him. Run around and punch him. The guy behind you? Yeah, punch him. Triangle. It's triangle. Always after you hit the button, it's triangle. Square. Why, why is it not? Oh. Square, square. Triangle. Now knock him out. Run over and knock him out. Don't snap his neck. You're fine. You just killed both targets in one go. Good job. Now climb down that thing and go down the, the pipe like you did before. I think you're going to get out of here. So what did you think of that? You just killed them both in one go. Yeah. So, yeah, you pushed him right on her. So if you said eliminate normally, that's just gonna kill him, and- Oh, you have to climb in that window. That's gonna eliminate him, and the race is just gonna stop. But if you wait until it says, uh, kill, you can kill them both at the same time. See, now you just gotta work your way down. So, you know where to do that. It was over there, you were going the right way. You <laughs> walking out like a ball. <laughs> to the right. Not in there, not in there, not in there, not in there. Oh yeah, it's over here. Over there. You'll get used to the map once you play more. You see that locked exit, exit over there? What? 
Yeah, see how it says locked? Some are unlocked, some are locked. And the locked ones, you need an item for. So, uh, actually, let's go do the locked one. You can get a little trophy for it. Or achievement in-game. Uh, so yeah, keep going down. Uh, actually, no. No, 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 you're fine. Yeah, go up there. Yeah, right there. You're good. To the left. Down those stairs. Yep, you go in the right place. And out those doors. Through the other building to your left. Go through that. Yeah, you can just run through it. This is the podium building. This is where they go. So just run right through it. There's nothing you need to do in here. So over there is the speedboat, and we're going to unlock it. You have to go out the door to your right. Yep. To the left. Towards the speedboat. Yeah, so the key is in that building right there, so just... Get in that building to your right. I forgot I had this. That building right there. Yeah, just get right in there. You should be able to open the door. If it's locked, then just climb in a different way. Uh, wait, just wait. Wait, 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 wait. You want to wait for him to walk by? Okay, now go. Go now, 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 now. Go ahead. You're fine now. He's not going to see you. Yeah, remember. Keys you can do whenever, but lock picks, it's illegal. So you need to... It's in here, right on that table. To your right. Uh, to the right. Right there. Good. No? Just go out to the end of the pier, and that's poison. Pick it up if you want, yeah. Now just head out the door, and head over to the speedboat exit right there. And you will have beaten Miami for the first time. <laughs> to the left. Mind you. Yep, right there. There's stairs to your right. It's down a level. Yeah, it's down there. Yeah, it's oh, the that bowl. Yep. So, like I said, you so can do this exits. so... Oh, there's like 20 different exits. And there's a few easter egg ones, too. <laughs> if you kill both targets in one disguise, you actually can race out onto the race course as an exit. You can't actually race it. It's an exit. You can escape on a dolphin. There's a lot of ways. There's a manhole cover through the way you came in. So much. So, there you go. X. You're gonna level up a whole bunch. I'm like level 70 something. <laughs> Jesus. <coughs> there you go. So. Yeah, have you hit next? That should bring you to it. Yeah, so now these are things you can use. So the. That's a smuggle location, so if you want to smuggle something in in the boat rental hut, you can. And it kind of shows you that that was that building you were just in. There you can smuggle something in that Kronstadt reception. So, you can smuggle stuff in the stands toilet, because that's where you want to put something, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> oh, now you have a sniper rifle you can bring in. Now you can use that pistol. Now all the loadout slots are available. You already were able to do that. Oh, now you have the briefcase. Now you got a fish. <laughs> now you got lockpack mark. It's the same thing as the lockpack mark one, I guess. Oh yeah, I, this is a little bit old stuff. You already, you, that's where you just started. Yeah. So you hit skip for now. You should go back and do that, that again. That, that's a really fun mission. Here's a cutscene if you want. Yeah, to I'll go it. do it. I'll keep it all in the same hour with the same. Uh... Berlin. I'll, I'll shut up. Shanghai. Montreal. We're bleeding operatives. Panic is spreading, and now we are axing our own. Knox was a traitor. He would have caused incalculable damage. And he won't. He's the last. This is exactly what the enemy wants. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptom. And I have just the tool for the job. Right. The Burnwood woman. Eric Soders warned you about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I can handle this Burnwood. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. And you ought to know. 
ICA speaks the enemy's language. We need them. And once we don't, <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Fact remains, we are shadow boxing. We need to know who we are up against. I was getting to that. His name is Lucas Gray, the late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Cobb was ground zero, first of our operatives to die. It had to be one of his staff, someone with military training and access to the plane. Ah, grasping at straws. Gray is a mercenary, a veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. Chechnya, Sierra Leone, the list goes on, but before 89, nothing. No records of any kind. Ah, oh, come on. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the curtain was lifted, I cast a very wide net. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. <clears throat> If you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, I couldn't give two shits where he came from. I only want to know one thing. How does he know about us? I swear to God, this hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. Like it or not, 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Just get me inside. Rico, I need a favor. All right, there was your cutscene. What'd you think? Yeah. The battlefield. Did you understand any of that? A little. <laughs> the battlefield uh, has some a lot of good cutscenes in it too. So, oh yeah, I'm sure. So um, basically, the the shadow client guy, that guy, that Lucas Gray, he's trying the one trying to fight the Providence, and the Providence are the bad people. And 47, he's been trying to hunt him. But he realizes, the Shadow Client, that they need 47 because he's the only one who remembers anything about this, the partners they're called. Oh. So, he's going to have to get him inside and they're going to have to try to reunite. I'm not going to tell you if that happens or not, but... Mm. So, he mentioned Delgado, Rico, Rico Delgado. He uh, is kind of going to set him up because that's your next target. Then, the here, the just go over is. the destinations quick. Go to destinations. Just watch the briefing for it. You don't have to do it now. Just watch the briefing for it. Okay, go over to destinations. R1. Oh. And Santa Fortuna, the next map. Yep, go ahead and hit that. And go ahead and watch your the briefing. Just hit that. Yep, right there. Is it on it already? Yep. Good morning, 47. Alright, watch this. are digging deep. Meanwhile, we've had a breakthrough of our own. Comparing the malicious attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes, we've figured out how Mr. Gray and his paramilitaries move around the world undetected. They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel, Colombia's biggest drug manufacturer. Clearly, Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgados. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the malicious strike range. But to do so, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. Sociopathic cartel head Rico Delgado and his two closest lieutenants, PR guru Andrea Martinez and savant chemist Jorge Franco. With equal parts guts and guile, Rico Delgado runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The word is, 
The brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado Logistics Network, while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. So, three of Colombia's most infamous crime lords inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to prepare. Mm hmm. So, yes, you heard it right. This one has three targets. Yeah. Not two. And there's no way to kill them all at the same time. One is in a mansion, one roams the streets, and one's in a drug lab. All in different parts of the map. <laughs> you can make them come to places together. There are ways to do that. And like, you can kill two of them at the same time, but you can't get all three at the same time. So, I uh, can leave that to you. Um, but then you have all the other maps, and then you got, yeah, back to Miami. So, are, are you just gonna play with Miami for a little bit? Yeah. More? Yeah? Alright, well, I'm gonna hop off, but good luck. Um, you can try the thing that you are doing yesterday, or you can try to kill them separately. If you want a little bit of inspiration to how you can do it, unique ways, go over and look at the challenges. Those will give you some good ideas. Like, assassinate him with the fish trophy. You get Try to find the fish trophy and see if you can find a way to lure him down. There's a lot of interesting ways, so look at the challenges if you want to give something new a try. But, that's R1 if you want to peek, but... Alright, what, um, how much time is left in a share play? 33. So, if you want to set a timer for like 30 minutes now, I'll give you about 3 minutes after your timer. <clears throat> so then get out and get a little intro. Outro. Are you enjoying Hitman 2? Yeah. It, I think it's really cool though how like all the missions have very different ways you can do them. It's not just one thing. Right. And there's so many different ways. And it's fun. Alright Wes, have a good one. Good luck to your rest of your Hitman endeavors. Kill both targets. Be be clever. Be unique. All right. Make me laugh. Yeah. Have a good one. Mate. <laughs> Bye. Peace. Bye. Bye, little broadcast thing. Sure. Plane bagel. Oh boy. I hit leave party and I'm still in it. Hello. <laughs> oh, it says please wait. I'm literally. Boo. Boo. Boo you. Where the heck did you go? Well, first we went to Mercados because I was craving Mercados. Oh, I can go for that too. Mercados. And then we went to Five Below up in Latham and then we went to Target. And now you we and home. Mom? 
Aha. <clears throat> I was craving my chicken parm. Star Hitman 2 yet? Nope. <clears throat> you know they have uh Battlefield 5, you should get that. It's that's a good game. I went through a first couple little missions at that. <clears throat> and then um I you really should get Oh wait, I got a gun. I can't go through that way. Oh <clears throat> um you really should get Rocket League. That's a lot of fun. That is a lot more fun than you'd think it would be. It's only Wednesday. There is still plenty of time left, folks, and anything can happen. It's just so neat. For newcomers to endurance racing, let me remind I finally won one again. I won by a lot the last game. Yeah, I was watching it actually. Even though I saw you jump in, play the game, and leave, you didn't even come into the party or anything. Huh? <laughs> How'd you find the broadcast? Because <laughs> I knew you were playing, so I went and looked. What did you search, though? Your name? Oh, because it's on a different account. Oh, wait, that's right. How did I get it? <coughs> oh, I noticed no, that... on the PlayStation app. Oh. Uh, and it went... I noticed that yesterday, too, because it came up with one viewer, and I was like, I wonder if that's Wesley. <laughs> but then I was like, wait, how would he have found it? That's why I forgot you what's, can get to it. What's friend. that account then? I don't even remember. What? What did? I... I don't remember what I named. Or did I just name it like the same thing? I don't. 
I don't remember. <laughs> And I could have even had another three points, but I didn't realize that. I thought when you started the field goal kick, it would let you finish it, but I guess not. Because <laughs> there were like four seconds left, and I started without timing out. So I didn't get to finish the kick. <clears throat> How the heck did they notice me? What the heck? No! Okay, well, already off to a not good start. Yeah, all three of you were one and one as I'm sitting here 0 and 2. <clears throat> yeah, did I see your final score last game was three to zero? Yeah. <laughs> One seven minute, goal. seven minute quarters, and that's all it was. And the oh, if you watch the broadcast, you're gonna be like, wow. Um, I uh, the messed up thing is I drove it. I was in field goal range to tie it, and I was, you know, I had plenty of time, <laughs> which is the messed up thing. And I just kept running up to the line and all that, saving my timeouts. Then I finally used one with 20 some seconds. I, I was trying to score a touchdown. And I didn't get to it. So seven, I called a timeout with seven seconds left. And I'm like, oh, I have time for one quick play and try to score. And I ran a play action, ran all the way outside. Ran <coughs> just out of bounds. And... <laughs> And the clock hit zero, and I was flipping. I'm like, I stepped. I was out of bounds first. <laughs> and you can't challenge it either. So I think I got dipped on that because it looked like I was out of bounds. No! It looked like no. I was out of bounds before that clock hit zero. Oh, I did get it. Okay. <clears throat> and when I was watching your stream, I don't know how. If I were you, I would try. Hi. I would definitely try. The view, go back, you know, use the view I use. I don't go, like that. But you can see like better either. on the throws, too. That, I don't that's, like it. That's hard to see with the throw. Maybe I should Where should I go here? <clears throat> oh, get out of the way, people.
Wow, how did I do that? I don't know. How's that game going? Then? <clears throat> I don't want to speak too soon, so I'm not going to answer that. Yeah, when you're done, we should share play. Uh, share play Rocket no, League thanks. quick, just so you could try it. It's a lot more no. fun. Yeah. I'm getting off of the PS4 once this game's done. <clears throat> Share play quick, or you can watch me no. at least. No, no. Yeah, yeah. No, no. <laughs> no. Oh well, I did a touchdown. Or not a touchdown. A. Oh wait, I can watch it. What am I talking about? <clears throat> <clears throat> Wait, what, what, what is, oh, you don't know the other name? I don't remember. <clears throat> Welcome to Miami, 47. The innovation race is on its last day, and it is down to the wire. Thousands of eager fans are gathered for the final laps of this unexpectedly close race. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car. Her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby expo <coughs> where Kronstadt is showcasing its new prototype car. The Kronstadt RK Mark III has seen fierce competition from the Chinese Kowloon Heavy Industries' new racer. Moses Lee, CEO of Kowloon, has taken a dominant lead and looks invincible. Sierra Knox will need to risk it all if she wants to win for the third year in a row. The stakes are as high as they can get. Oh my god, somebody get him, jeez. Why, why do they always catch up when they do that? <sighs> well... <laughs> There goes that lead that I had. yawn I was <laughs> what <laughs> on the stream what? I heard it oh did I yawn <laughs> yeah probably <laughs> oh my god
No! <laughs> it's the thing! Are you kidding me? Oh no! No! Uh, I couldn't do that again if I tried. I think you were hired by some holder right there. Look back, open up. I understand. Got a fist. Of course. Always works when it's the other team that does that. There went that game. <laughs> what happened? They must have intercepted it and brought it back. Got a touchdown. <clears throat> must have intercepted it. What are you talking about? What do you mean? Did your stream stop? No. Should you have? Oh, there it goes. Wow, you had a 17-7 lead. I, yeah. So, uh, yeah. I had to think of what you just said. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, really? You couldn't catch that? It was right to you! Oh. <laughs> Come on. Yikes. <clears throat> hey, you! This is a restricted area! Sir, you will need to follow me. Please comply and come along. No! Oh, come on, just get past the line! <laughs> Are you what kidding me? What the heck me? was that? I couldn't just get past that line. Yeah. Let me just, uh... Oh, 
Are you kidding me? Please. I right, still got a chance. Uh -huh. Oh, third and three. Shoot, I thought that was third down already. Oh, man. Of course. Well, <laughs> they always catch the ball, so it doesn't. <laughs> they get a first down? Mm hmm. If they do anything like what I did last game, was take a bunch of kneels at the end. Nope, they didn't. Well, you might have to. <laughs> you got three timeouts, remember? Yeah, well, I don't. There's no hope well, for me. <laughs> yeah, there is if you stop them. Timeout? Mm. Nope, there's seven seconds left. Seven? Well, that's because you're letting the clock go. And there's the end. Wow. I don't play anyone this season. Nobody. Stay on, I'll go on. Uh, Rocket no, League. I was just about to Ugh. get off. <coughs> Adios. Mm. It's only Wednesday.
Hmm. Adios! See. Copy? Still looking. No sign of any perks. Well, what a race, folks. And don't forget to ask yeah, the over there. t shirt I'm at the exit. Buy one, get one free. Oh, that's right. Goddamn. You heard me. Buy one, get one free. Ladies and gentlemen, this year's innovation race is now over, and it's time to hand the trophy to the very deserving winner. It has been a tremendously exciting race with drama. All right, well, I'm gonna head over to Rocket League. I think so. <clears throat> That's that. That was an hour of this, so see you later, and see you over in Rocket League. If you hear Snowy in the background snoring, he is loud.